claiming is more expensive, but here I don't think it's any different. We'll put some claims and some stuff over here. Here, we want your planet over here. Ah, um, we're gonna make these claims. And there you go, conquer, set war goal, done. Yeah, so we're probably doomed, but you know. Uh, right, delete that design. The wake over here. Coil guns. That hasn't changed yet. Does not have enough power. We'll remove the afterburners for now. I think we are researching better power things. Um, we'll upgrade you. Um... platform in the queue now whether we have enough time for it i don't know living metal okay charted. are you serious has room for we don't have gene clinic yet so we'll do the temple first construction complete oh a scientist has died it's probably one of our level fives fusion reactor nice we can do another ship design very quickly um yeah we don't care about that we'll take the energy credits from technicians is better Uh, I don't actually know if I can modify you now. Yeah, while well, the fleet is upgrading. Hold on. Halt the upgrade process. Throw the afterburners back on. Boom. Done. Um, are we close to another tech breakthrough? No. All right. So we'll go ahead and go back to upgrading you for now, then. Construction complete. So they haven't moved in on the AC yet. That's nice. A science ship over here. Um, you know what? We still have a lot to explore. Anomaly discovery chance. Excellent. Go, go. Construction complete. Construction complete. Excellent. You have gone claim this system. So this is just minerals. Lots of mining stations. Done. Well, when we get destroyers, maybe. Cool, man. Uh, you're just chilling over here. Yeah, we can't afford Vessels to spend um, alloys on you. Sorry, bro. No expansion over there. New ships are coming on board. Negative food. Wow. Hey, you're just about to get jobs over there. Hey, well, let's go ahead and build a farm here. Star system charted. Purple rain. Inspired arts. Oh man, now I got that song in my head. Enemy presence. So what are you looking at here? 870. Well, I mean, we can hold station under this. Attack. With this station, we can Star definitely hold them charted. off, but they will get some ticking war score. Once, you know, more ships get built complete. and our upgrades happen. Tactical once we get our tier two weapons, that'll make a big difference. Oh, we can probably scan them now. Hold on. No, no, no. So you're all Corvettes. You got some lasers, which are bad against shields. And you've got tier two shields. And tier one armor. Okay, well the tier two projectile weapons will be good. And then yeah, if we can just get some an extra tier of shields, that wouldn't be bad. Create armies so you can take more. I'm not gonna create the armies yet because we're not in a position to push forward and they do cost a lot of maintenance. I mean, I know the armies take a while to build, but Enemy I'm just gonna wait a beat here. Star system charted. So yeah, they might be really annoying over here for a while. Oh, diggy diggy hole. Come to my neck rats. At the center of the city, overlooking the main square is a grand and ostensibly decorated palace with a garish neon sign advertising the empress motel inside are lavish chambers filled to the room with treasure from which the empress and her board of trusted advisors govern is also where the hoarders held their last stand defending their empress and the precious rubricator with any luck the rubricator can still be found in its usual spot by the empress's lilac ribbon okay i suppose i could sell some more artifacts for money and then use that to buy alloys i forgot about this complete. 
Um, ooh, Elgain Insight, which would be nice, but no, we'll sell. We're going to sell a bunch of private collectors. Done. Tons of money. Tons of alloys. Excellent. I will reinforce more. Please and thank you. Construction complete. Yeah, we might be able to bait them into attacking over here. Although, right now, I'm still going to wait until the fleet's a little bit more prepared. Where have they gone, I wonder? That's the problem. We don't have enhanced sensors yet, so we really can't track them. Okay, there they are over here. Station under attack. And they got some Special more stuff coming through. Complete. Oh, former battle colony, the Shattered. The crew of the Asimov were initially certain they had made a triangulation mistake when deducing the coordinates of the supposed battle colony in the Nimelin system, having found nothing but asteroids where they expected a life-bearing planet. However, a closer study of the asteroid's composition has convinced has revealed that they're in fact what remains of the former Bal colony. The once lush planet has been blown into several thousand rocky pieces by some unknown collision, occurring roughly seven million years ago. Deductions suggest the Grunart played some role in the planet's dark fate. One particularly promising asteroid has been selected for further study is that it appears to possess a large number of fossilized life forms from the lost planet. So plus one colony is discovered and it creates an archeological site. Found. Okay, we are going to finish Supremacy over here, giving us a Fleet Command Limit Increase, Admiral Level Cap Increase, War Games. And it finishes Supremacy, which unlocks the War Doctrine policies and an Ascension slot. I think we go Mind Over Matter for, for Telepathy. Telepathy. Let's do it, man. Let, let's go Telepathic. Right? Right? And what are our policies for our war doctrines? Oh, do we actually have to unlock them? They're grayed out. Maybe I have to let the game run for a sec. Mind bullets. Oh, I love it. Mind over matter. Boom. Yes. Done. Excellent. Modify pops in the Cult of Fallen Earth by adding the latent Sinic trait. The Psychor building is now available. Sinic armies can now be recruited. <laughs> Ah, there we go. Now they're, they're ungrade. Excellent. So defense and depth, home territory fire rate plus 10%. That's going to be useful right now. Hit and run, increase and disengage, less risk, rapid deployment. Uh, faster sublight speed and ship weapon range is really good. I mean, defense and depth right now, we're going to leave on, but we'll probably switch to rapid deployment later on. Hey, <laughs> real retreat. We can't actually run it. So, ships already at full strength. Oh, I think, yeah, because they're being built up, which is okay. Although, our fleet limit has gone up, so we could actually go and change this. So we could spend more. Although, ooh, uh, we probably don't want to go over 24, actually, because the costs go up quite a bit. Well, we'll see. We could always go over our, our naval capacity for a little while. Let me build it up to 24 for now. So lots of stuff is in the queue, which is okay. Uh, you're over here. Oh, Alpha Centauri. These are probably some more, um, like, just critters we can pick up or something like that. Psycorp gives me serious started. Babylon 5 vibes. Yeah. It also gives me a little bit of um, Starship Troopers vibe. So yeah, we'll have to build a Psycorp on one of our planets so that we can get some excellent forces. Kleptomaniac Rats. A section of the floor at the ruins being excavated on Sismac 4 recently gave away, sending several of our archaeologists tumbling down a small chasm. Fortunately, they not only emerged unharmed from the incidents, but also found several minor artifacts. Well, one minor artifact, technically speaking, but sure. So we're even amounts of war exhaustion right now. Coprolite Asteroid Poop Rock. Yeah, there can be more upgrades. Um, how far are we to our armor? 12, that's not bad. You do have the tier 2 guns. Let's go ahead and upgrade to whatever the latest version is right now, actually, because I think a lot of these are getting the tier 2 guns that didn't before, so it's worth upgrading that right now. Progress. Station under attack. Pretty sure it's an explicit B5 reference. Complete. Several Stars minors, several super minor that were assembled into one minor. <laughs> uh, you, there we go. Go back to auto exploring. Although, yet, yeah. are you gonna balk at going through here? Because it's got like 
enemy stuff in here? I don't know. We wow, money's going down real fast. Enemy presence exposed. We are now 1.2k fleet strength, which is actually slightly more than they've got. We're still assembling. Zero G construction vessel under attack. There's she aliens. Well, let's research the she aliens here. Um, we're gonna let the upgrade finish, and then we're gonna move out and retake some of our territory over here. It is much better. They've made it so that like the upgrades actually happen one ship at a time. So if you gotta cancel, some of your ships still get upgraded. Vessels upgraded. That went over a hundred percent. You see that? All right, we're gonna move you over here. Do this. Might not want to engage the fleet right away. Although, if we can engage them while we've got one of our outposts on our side, that will help a little bit. Star system chart. I guess what I can do is I can put you on passive. Because what'll happen, I'm still going to engage these by simply virtue of moving Attacking to this system. And then if we sit in one of these systems with the outposts, um, when Attacking an enemy fleet retreat. comes in, we won't move out to engage them. Yeah, I was going to say this science ship is going to yeah want to run away here. Excellent. Done. Now, the enemy fleet's here. I think I want to stay right in this system here. Because I don't know where else they're going to go. Okay, we've collected some specimens. Construction complete. There we go. Final ship is coming. So they were here, they're probably coming to Voom. Tactical retreat. Yeah, because they're not there anymore. Man, well, I would love to have some sensors. Us. We met the Havel Enlightened Kingdom. They're fanatic authoritarians like me. They're also pacifists, but listen. You don't hate me. Oh my god, wait. You guys like me. Do we have mutual rivals? <gasps> Could I guarantee their independence? We make friends. They're wary. They're almost there. Hold on. I'm going to guarantee your independence, buddy. Which is kind of stupid, but sure. I know we need energy. Well, I can sell some more stuff, including and probably what's going to happen. We're going to keep selling relics. There you go. Earn a bunch of money real quick here. Where the hell is their fleet? Well, we're still getting our reinforcements coming in, so I'm going to wait here until all the reinforcements are in place, and then we'll move forward. Oh, they're here! And they are moving to the center. We, again, the outpost isn't very powerful, but that's okay. I'm going to go ahead and put you on aggro now just to make sure you jump in, although they would have come into range. So this thing could tank a little bit for us, which is really good. And yeah, we have vastly superior forces compared to them. Okay. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to clean up these systems and take them back. And then we're going to move out. And then at some point, we're going to go to this station, kick its ass, land on there. Improved deflectors. Basic combat rolls is sort of a free upgrade, though, for stats. I, I will take the deflectors, though. We've got tons of energy on our ships because of our, our things, so that's going to be handy. Uh, you guys wait there. I still don't have a ton of alloys. And I do have some debris to go and scan, though. Um, yeah, I'll wait until these are cleared out. You're evading hostiles. Yeah, that's fine. Attacking enemy assets. They also came in less than half their armor due to taking down stations. Yeah, and that's true, too. Yeah, we just let them attrition themselves over here. Research. Research. Technology secured. What is this technology? Ah, our armor upgrade. That's also going to be nice. Yeah, we're going to hold off on the living metal for a good long time here. Um, I'm going to unlock the, the hangar bays, which are really nice for our ships. We actually haven't had much trade value going on here, unfortunately. No piracy, which I guess is a side effect of that. But that's one of the reasons our finances are so poor. Retreat. Attacking enemy assets. Gonna halt you. There we go. Life electric. Skill level exile goes up. That's nice. Come over here and scan this Debris for me, please and thank you. There we 
I'm gonna come over here and build some stations. Retake all this stuff. That living ocean planet had Betharian fields, which helped your energy problem immensely once worked. Uh, um, how do you know it had Betharian fields? How did you know that? We didn't actually open up the screen. Oh, you can switch your war policy now. Yeah, thanks, actually. That's a good point. Um, the war doctrine, we don't need defense in depth. We're going to go with rapid deployment, which is always going to be good. I did open that? I have no memory of this. Oh, mapping the stars just ran out. Um, the Claire Saint as well. We have a lot of influence. We'll go for another dose of map the stars. And let's go for more Declare Saint for influence. Star system or for a unity. It was, in the, it, it was open in the colonization window. Oh. Star system oh. Charted. Hold on. Ah, when you colonize, it shows you the thing. Okay, yeah, I did not remember opening that up. Ooh, look at the metal boneyard. Society research. Good gosh. Anomaly found. Observe moon impact. Well, that's a time project, right? Yeah. We'll send someone out there. Um, actually, where is it? Gozum. Oh, where we already are here. Research the project. Archaeology. Kleptomaniac rats. The archaeologists were preparing to leave when they happened upon a large hidden chamber cluttered with artifacts, not bones, and a substantial amount of fresh slobber. There, under a used royal nose swab, a four-legged table with a carving of a face they confirmed was indeed funny, sat the rubricator, maker of thingamajigs, right where it's supposed to be. A tiny, insignificant-looking cube spewing out a continuous stream of artifacts. The rubricator is a replicator. Oh, an ingenious alien invention that can make endless copies of just about any artifact, and soon it's ours. Planetside team will begin their journey back to the safety of the ship. Thankfully, we will never know what attacked the hoarders. Excellent. Uh-huh. Ah, there it is! Okay! It is the same event as before. Talons from the Void. A snarling, hissing fiend has appeared out of the Void. With one swipe of her gigantic talons, she snatched the archaeology shuttle, carrying the excavation team and the rubricator back to the CFE Kepler, bending it open and prying the rubricator from within. It seems we have finally had the displeasure of meeting the hoarding rat's assailant. The dragon must have been attracted by their countless treasures and made her nest within the royal palace, feasting upon their bodies. Perhaps she was on the prowl or observed from afar as we excavated the ruins, waiting for the right moment to strike. She appears to be growling something in our general direction. We can translate her animal noises or engage evasive maneuvers. I can't pre-dismiss the scientist. No, no, it's fine. This, this intern was set there to die. I mean, I know they reached level four at this point, but nope. The rats went squeak, squeak, squeak. Their, then their bones went crunch, crunch, crunch. Now it is your turn to tickle the inside of Shard's belly. Yes, you have nutty little ones. The rubricator belongs to Shard. <laughs> Get back the rubricator this instant. A thunderous rumble erupts from the dragon's belly. Suddenly, her wings are wrapped around the ship, her steamy breath fogging up the windshield as she peers inside, a maniacal glint in her eyes. How did she get so close so fast, and is she smiling? Why wet my appetite? Why you wet my appetite, little ones? She purrs softly, then lunges at it with all her might, fangs exposed. Rip science ship. So yeah, so uh, there's now like a, you know, Skull difficulty space dragon in Sismic over here. You know, right next to her capital. This is fine. I'm not worried at all. Mm -mm. Um, hey, debris. Let's research this. I'm actually going to go and send the fleet to home first because a lot of these are pre, like two hull points left in this Corvette. So let's go and, and send you home. Uh, upgrade whoever ships need upgrading, as well as making sure to, um... Oh, is there someone else there doing that? Uh, as well as upgrading anyone who might need upgrading. Let's go and send you here. The Kepler over here. Oh, did they make it out? Because this was the Kepler over here, wasn't it? They may have made it out, I'm not sure. Sir. 
Space Dragon. Preposterous. All dragons dead with Eris Targaryen. <laughs> Guarantees of independence. Ah, we did like each other a little bit more a while ago. Star system charge. Pull back the um, the guarantee of independence. It was a pretty ludicrous guarantee. Okay, we have no alloys. I think because it's going to here. Oh, we're over our cap of um technology yeah secured. 26 to 24 so that's a little bit more for the expense gene clinics we should now build <gasps> sonic armies it's pretty expensive though i'm just gonna get some tile blocker tech for now first fleet's fully repaired excellent uh a bunch of you are waiting for upgrades yeah go ahead special project complete Oh, we observed the collision with the moon. Can we go here? Yeah, okay, good. Apparently new to Stellaris, got any advice for me? Brandon, I don't know, man. It just, you gotta enjoy the ride. Like, it's, the, Stellaris is a lot about the story. It's really good. Do watch your various resources, you know. Having the negative energy is kind of sucky. There's always gonna be something that you have too much of and something else you don't have enough of. At least you can sell and trade and things. And you will have to. Um, let's go to... Con oh, not there. Yeah, we don't have the uh, resources. Because we're using all of our alloys on the upgrade. Okay, let's move out here. And then here. We can cancel those upgrades for now. That's fine. Uh, let's go ahead and recruit some armies. Which right now is just going to be regular armies. We don't have our psychic stuff yet. I don't know how many we're going to need because we don't know how much is on each of these planets. But I'm going to do this. Three at Earth that was, and then pair at the other two. Anomaly I think Sirius is a little further forward. We could have done that slightly more. Most likely, because it's not their capital, they may not have anyone there. Oh, I should probably go and get this. Let me actually do this and then maybe do another round of repair before we go to the um the actual star base over here i can't believe this has gone so well but i mean they want to yeah, look they're pathetic compared to us yeah fleet power is pathetic that's because we destroyed their entire fleet maybe nice just click this recruitment of armies completed completed and then a little bit more on Earth. Star Just gonna wait for that to happen. Star crazed. The crew in Santa Monica made an unfortunate discovery. I'd like to suspect that the pulsating pattern observed in Keb Darren was in fact due to seltzer manufacturing. Oh. Um, Science officer April Lawrence has become delusional and is currently under the impression that she's the protector of the realm and that stars are pulsating coded warnings about coming apocalypse. The crew believes she herself manipulated ship sensor data into a, during a psychotic spell. April Lawrence is now in a medical pod headed back to Earth that was where she will receive treatment. Twinkle, twinkle, little star, gain some society research. Sphere of influence expanded. Um, I'm just going to cancel. I'm just going to trash the science ship for now. I don't want to spend more money on more scientists at this time. We got to do trim this down. <gasps> the Infinity Machine, finally! We went and helped. We cannot bear to see you spend more of your limited time helping us. You have done your part. You are very helpful. Maybe the heat death of the universe won't happen before we finish now. The task remains and we shall finish it. Now your reward. Do you wish to learn one of our secrets or do you wish to solve your own problems? Uh, wish to learn one of your secrets would gain us positronic AI and influence or or a permanent 5% boost to research speed. Just give her the title of Saint, that's nice. Positronic AI, is is that robot tech? Oh, 12 years left, nice. We don't need AI, no, no. We want a permanent, yeah, singularity processor, 5% research speed. Boom, the second option thematically, Tactical yeah. Retreat. Mm -hmm. All right, fleet, 